Blue. Uh, this review is of Transformers Prime Legion Class Tailgate. I believe it's Tailgate. Should be Tailgate. Let's just tilt the camera down a bit so we can get a little bit of a better look at the little fella. This is a repaint of Cliff Jumper from the same line. But look at that flame paint. Ah, oh, it's this lovely metallic blue with flames. And ah, oh, I loved this guy as soon as I saw him. I found him way back when on sale for three pounds, and it was like mine. First Cyberverse figure I ever got because I thought the idea was stupid before I got him. And he's just amazing. He's just he completely turned me around on the whole idea. Uh, he's got, not sure how well you can see that, that's all that. It's basically like one of Bumblebee's arm guns, like if you're in Put Dog, uh, but basically moulded in this horrible lime jelly clear plastic, or jello if you're American. That was your Independence Day yesterday, I'll teach you. Jeff Goldblum for the win. But yeah, so that's it's not bad, and it just pegs in the top there, or it can go in either side. But yeah, whatever. Uh, but yeah, he's just a lovely little thing. I mean, I added a little bit of black for the uh, exhausts and the ball bars on the front. And, yeah, not a lot, but it's rubbed off, so who cares? And got a tiny little Autobot symbol there. But he's just lovely. He's just ah, uh, you know what? There's, I've not found a Cyberverse figure of this size that is anywhere as good as him. I started off strong. So, should we transform him? Uh, let's have a look, see. Right, you gotta kind of split the legs at the back. Head reveal! Da -da. Split legs, fold them over. And then, this piece is on a ball joint, you just twist it underneath, and forward. And that makes the foot. So, bring the legs straight, twist underneath, and forward. So you end up like that. You gotta split this whole front section. So about there. And just fold it over the top onto the waist. Which is there. And then you bring these up. Bring the arm out. And then turn this piece. Ball joint, turn out, and there's his arm. Which is brilliant. And you do it on the other side, you bring it out. And then you turn it over. And that's it. Now, this is a Legion class figure. Ball joint shoulders, ball joint elbows, ball joint hips, hi uh, hinge in the knee, and a ball joint on the foot. What kind of articulation can you get on a figure that size? Ever. Because it just blows me out of the water how awesome this guy is. Um, he's got a nice little head sculpt. It's nothing to write home about, but it's alright. Not that you guys can see it, but you know, um, I did black the horns up, but they've rubbed off. But he's got a nice little bit of detail in the waist and everything like that. And he's just a lovely little figure. I mean, he's just, I love the amount of articulation and everything. And he can hold this ridiculous gun, because why not? And he's just cool. I mean, he's just, he really is, he's just a cool little figure. I mean, the cliff jumper in this... It's just plain red. And I don't think it lends to the mould as well as this does. I mean, you look at the back and he just looks like an absolute mess. But when he's got a paint job like that, why are you looking at the back of him? What's wrong with you? <coughs> so, let's get a couple of sides. Uh, well, you see, the reason I got this guy was I was originally looking for Flame War, which is an RC repaint. But the character was made by Benson Yee of BWTF.com, who is a legend. Uh, he's done a lot of work for Transformers in the background. He actually created the character. She's been in a couple of the comic books, or I believe. Yeah, yeah, a couple of them. Uh, so I, I did find her. Ta-da! And unfortunately, this figure, the arms are like one solid piece, basically. And it's not as good as I hoped it was, unfortunately. Because I started off really strong with him. I mean, this is still a good figure. But it's not a patch on him. He's just... So, 
let's see if we can get size comparisons. She's same size, a little bit smaller. That's a mini con. So he's a little bit bigger than an old mini con. And that's Chop Shop I got the other day. So if that's the size of the new Legend, Basic, whatever they're calling them, class, that's how small he is. He's the next step down. But he's still really good. The articulation he's got is pretty much the same as this. In fact, no, he's got ball joint feet. He hasn't. So he wins. <laughs> I, I, I can't explain it. He's just awesome. Uh, after him, I got... Well... I got quite a few Cyperverse after that. I mean, you know... I've got a little box over there full of them, but... Yeah, he's he's just awesome, and I, I really like him. So, oh, God, shit. You know what? Let's transform the flame more very quickly. She doesn't transform very nicely, but we'll transform it quickly. Uh, I also don't like the weapon she came with. It's really stupid. But that's not really her fault. She's just a remold with a different weapon. Uh, sorry, repaint with a different weapon. So, you know, can't blame her for it, but, you know, still irritating. So you, as you do this again, it's been a long time since I've transformed any of these, by the way. Right, let's see, just bring that leg out, fold the wheel up, bring this leg down, you got to fold the wheel in, so one folds up, one folds in, then you got to split this back piece, bring that to the sides, rotate this down to the back, and there you go. And the Decepticon symbol started to rub off. What a shame. And um, that's her. And let's try to stand her a little bit better. The thing is, with the wings, she's a little bit antisocial. But... So, she's quite a bit smaller as well. It's not really her review, but they're very simple little figures. So, she's, she's nice. She's a nice repaint. Yeah, Decepticon girl. Biker, but I completely forgot to put in my Fembots review. But she's Cyberverse, so I didn't really want to do that. But still, yeah, so he's awesome, she's alright. So, yep, yeah, that's that's a review for you. <laughs> They're little figures, there's not a lot to talk about, I'm sorry, there's really not. I mean, he has got kind of molded in feet in there, so it's not just a big empty panel, but, you know. So... <laughs> I'm having fun doing this today because it's been a while. Sorry, kids. Uh, yeah. I should be ugly, I should be wretched, and I shall see you all again in the next one. Bye!